Hey everybody, Ginger on Wheels here. That's a crazy cat. So today's a big day, as usual. Uh, I did something, I found a deal. It was such a good deal. So I went on Craigslist. I found a van. Yeah, it's a 1999 Dodge Ram B1500. I think it's a V10. It is old. It smelled funky when I went to, to go test drive it and the lady assured me that it was totally fine and that she'd been living in it and there was nothing wrong with it. And I bought it, took out the carpet, and it's looking a little moldy. I took a rug doctor to it yesterday and spent probably five hours in there with a the rug doctor and pulled eight gallons of like black sludge out of the carpets and the walls, the, just the interior, the ceilings and everything. It was nasty. There is what resembles a pee stain on the uh, sleeping area. Let's go check the van out. I'll show you this thing in person. There she is. Paint job looks good from far away, but up close, this is actually just like house paint. Someone just took a paintbrush to it and was like, eh, I don't like this burgundy color. We're gonna go blue. This is the uh, plywood bed that's in the back. Just some Reflectix uh, covers to cover the windows that were pre-cut. I did buy some more Reflectix and I'm gonna cut again because these are really poorly cut. I went over this, I went over the plywood yesterday with a rug doctor to see if I could get the smell out and I could not. Because as you can see here, this is all splotchy and moldy and just generally not good. There's a solar panel on the roof and there's a solar controller right there on the wall. The battery was right here and this whole area is just totally moldy. But anyway, enough about the bad stuff. Let's look at the good stuff. The windows work. Hey, we got back windows. It's got the high top. So this is the inside area. That was where there was like a queen size bed there. And I'm gonna totally pull this whole plywood thing out and rebuild it with like a folding bed. Got a storage up here, that's pretty far back. Um, some speakers, those work. Speakers down here, those work. Little storage compartments, right there and there. There's like some strange blower thingy in here that is on when the car is on, but I'm not sure what it does. It's like an auxiliary blower. And this is this, the moldy carpet that needs to come out. 160,000 miles on this van and the seats are in primo condition. Check it out. I did shampoo them yesterday though. Steam cleaned them with the Rug Doctor upholstery attachment, which by the way is an amazing little tool. I'm on the fence if I should get new tires or not. The tires are worn but they're
orange soup going on right there. And it smells like Clifford the Big Red Dog's butthole. Anyway, I decided I'm just going to pull up the floor and pull out all this wood stuff because it's all going to be replaced anyway and I need something to do. So that's something to do. All right, so I'm pulling the floor out and I just found the reason why this is all rotted. That was my first clue. There's water in the holes in this plastic thing and the water is like rotty and moldy. And so that's been there for a while. So I look up and I notice these are all corroded and grody. So is this. And then I see this. Totally shot. So water has been just running down here or I guess down this side. And then just making its way on in, rotting everything in its path. And that is just unfortunate. I wish I could describe the smell to you. It's like a mix of wet dog and the bottom of an aquarium when you're cleaning it out. And also like dirty laundry bin. Yeah, so I'm glad I pulled all this out and going through this extra effort because this is totally gross. Okay, update. Pulled this out of the wall. There was a mold in the subfloor around that little motor thing. Got the floor out. This number one priority now is just finishing this carpet. 100% that's where the smell was coming from. I just had to stop this far in because I was just gagging. But this is just totally rotted. Ugh. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're getting out of there. <coughs> Holy crap. <coughs> that smells so bad. Oh. <coughs> okay. <sighs> fresh air, fresh air. <coughs> Good goddamn. Gonna need a mask. Alright, so that is the update on that. Once I get the front carpet out, I'm hoping the van will be a lot better. <coughs> I can't even 